How's it going, everybody? Welcome to an episode of The Hangar Cure. I'm Brandon. Today, I'm joined with Christopher. What's up? Who shows up in all of the chicken sandwich videos. Yeah, and true. his cousin, Jenny. This is Jenny. Hello. We're going to go and try the new A&W Nashville hot chicken sandwich, and we're going to see how it compares to the other chicken sandwiches we've had. Now, Jenny, I don't think you've had the other chicken sandwiches, or am I wrong? I have probably ate them. Yeah, yeah. but which ones? What are you talking about? Um, I've had Popeyes. What was the other one? Popeyes. 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 <laughs> Popeyes. What did you think of that one? Ah, uh, it was good. I liked it. That one was very good. That yeah. was actually probably my favorite. Uh, uh, which Mary other Browns. ones have you tried? And Mary, I'll see if I ate them or not. Mary Browns. Mary Browns. I've had Mary oh, Browns. Oh, Mary Browns okay. was really good. That was a yeah. good one. Uh, KFC mm, uh, wasn't really mm, a favorite. Yeah, that wasn't. wasn't KFC. Yeah. I don't really react well to spice, but because this is called the Nashville hot chicken sandwich, I'm going to have the spice this time, and I'm going to sacrifice my feelings. What do you drink here usually? Because they have that. Uh, they have I, I, oh, the root beer. Oh, yeah, I usually get root beer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, root beer float. float. Oh my god, I haven't had that in so long. It's been a while, yeah. It's been a while. <laughs> to be honest, float. I've never had one. I've never had. You never had a root beer float? I've never had it. Pretty good. I've nope. never had one. Maybe I can have one today. But anyways, we're gonna go inside and let's go check this sandwich out. Are we going? What's this, Chris? My mask. This isn't a mask. That's, is... that's one short. That's... <laughs> it is. Ask them how much for the, the bin of onions. <laughs> so I'm gonna get the onion rings. They're gonna get the fries. I usually go with onion rings anytime I come here because they're just amazing. And I'm gonna eat some of Chris's fries because that's what friends are. Dude, how are you supposed to see? Like your your glasses fog up. Look at this. That looks lethal. Oh my goodness. Oh, smell it. When you smell it, the spice hits you too. That's spicy, man. Actually? <laughs> yeah. So there's the sandwich. It's a baby. It's a baby. It's got sauce on top. Oh, the pickles. Three pickles. pickles That's what makes these important. things. They're bread and butter pickles. Don't waste those pickles, man. That's a sin. I mean, pickles are important in a chicken sandwich. I wish it was dill pickle, because bread and butter is a bit sweet. Not as spicy as it looks, but it's good. So what I usually get here is the onion rings, because these onion rings are perfect. You said there's dairy in this? Yes. That is lethal for me. You should mix the dairy into the root beer then. Oh! Spin it. Why spin it? Because, like, it, oh. makes, it mixes it better. All right. You guys don't even eat your fast food, right? You're supposed to rip the bag open. I was just watching you do that, and I'm like, wow, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> That's what you're supposed to do, because if you have ketchup, which I don't, you're supposed to, um. I do! Ow! Oh, it's French's. No, it's Heinz or nothing. So, onion rings always to start. Hmm. put the onion rings inside the sandwich. <gasps> Listen, I've only been a genius for so long. <laughs> Oh, delicious. Oh! It's really good. That is very good. Mm -mm. Did you eat a pickle? I see what you mean, but I, I kind of like it. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like that pickle. You eat that pickle? That's like a big piece of chicken. Dude, that's a very generous piece of chicken they gave us. This, man, this is a good sandwich, even with the spicy. Like I said, I don't do spice at all. I can't because uh, it's not so uh, nice to me, but. Mm. It's actually not that spicy. The Popeye's one was spicier. Really? Yeah. Beating. What do you mean? I, I yeah. thought near the end it got really spicy. Yeah, my eyes are just watering. Mm. <coughs> the spice was at the back of the sandwich. <laughs> it's all here, man, look. Maybe that pickle will save you. Mm. Pickle Rick. 40. 
Oh, my lips are literally on fire right now. It's actually perfect that they give a root beer float with this sandwich. Very good. Okay. I think the sandwich is actually really good. It is head to head. It's really hard to say. <laughs> Christopher, what the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> The Nashville hot chicken sandwich is fantastic. I probably would put it up there with the Mary Browns and the Popeyes. So pretty much all the chicken sandwiches are good. KFC is not really uh, the strongest. Here. This uh, was delicious. This was like a big, like they actually gave you like a big piece of chicken. Not yeah, like the other massive. ones was like, like kind of like, it's like almost like a half piece of chicken or a weird shape. You know, this was a hefty piece of chicken. The spice could have been distributed throughout. Like I, I felt like I only got real spice right at the end. We pretty much tried most of the chicken sandwiches on the market. We just have to try the Swiss Chalet. Hangry Cure Season 1 has pretty much become the chicken sandwich show. So we're going to go and try that one next at some point. That is the end of this episode of the Hangry Cure, everybody. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. Don't follow Jenny on Instagram. <laughs> but if you want to follow Chris on Instagram, his Instagram is in the description below. And let me know some of your Hangry Cures. And maybe we'll go and explore those too. And that's pretty much it. Take care. Stay frosty. Bye. Chris, Chris, why are you wearing sunglasses right now? <laughs> it's literally nighttime. Because I can't see without them. <laughs>